I hold this. And lay down. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hand go. Oh my god. Before you landing, head down, okay? Okay, before the landing, because we put brake system down there, kind of bumpy, okay? Okay, okay, okay. I hold this. Okay, and my bag, I've got my bag, okay. Oh my god, yeah, I think so. Oh, bye. Ooh. What is up guys and welcome from the incredible El Nido. Today I'm in the town to start my conquest to find some of the best views from above starting with this beautiful cliff, the Tower Cliff. So apparently there is a hike that you can do on the Tower Cliff which has been quite dangerous with accidents in recent years. So they have started something called the Canopy Tour and that is what I'm going to be doing today to go and check out some of the views from above. It looks like you have a couple of options. You have like the Canopy Walk but then you also have something that's called like the Dream Catcher. They are two different packages. So the first package is just doing the Canopy Walk with the views which will be 430 whereas if you add the Dream Catcher on top it's 730. So I'm going to opt to do the Dream Catcher as well because I think if you're going to be here you should do the full experience and it looks really really nice yeah so just a canopy walk with the view deck is 450 but then combined it's 730 which i don't think is bad just watch out for the times because this is only what i saw when i got here which is that at half past 11 there is a lunch break so you don't want to get here at half past 11 and then have to wait till 1 p.m but i can also understand why well first of all they need to eat obviously but second of all it is so hot i should have actually come here earlier i think it's now about 10 30 and i think the earlier you get here the better because the sun is lethal so um yeah i'm hoping i survive with the heat yeah so we got some safety warnings no jumping <laughs> no pregnant women be careful razor sharp stony and slippery stairs so yeah we are going to a cliff but just looking at that like i'm really excited to go and see the views yeah so i think it's quite a clever strategy because like i said you can actually do a rock climbing uh, to the top of the cliff but because this cliff is like really rugged, they have actually been um, accidents in the recent years. So I think that's a very clever alternative to do a bit more of an easy walk, still get the views and not risk your safety. Okay, so before I get started, like there's not a guide at the moment, he's coming down. We're going to get protected in the harnesses, we're going to have a safety helmet, so we're going to be nice and safe. I do think it's very important to also realize like what type of clothing to wear because you can see some people coming in on flip-flops and dresses and stuff like I can imagine that if you've got a dress on and you put the harness on it's not gonna be very comfortable and also not look very uh, flattering so make sure that you've got some comfy clothing on probably some shorts I've got sandals on so I can actually walk I won't lose a shoe but uh, just keep that in mind because you are gonna be walking uh, you know through the trees and stuff like this so you don't want to you don't want to be losing any of your items Okay, so maybe settle up in this one? Okay, well, I put my legs on. Okay, number one, Ooh, leg double two. Okay, wait, let me just pull my shorts nicely so that this doesn't get uh, embarrassing. <laughs> okay, okay, being all strapped in. Thank you for my safety. <laughs> okay, we're all uh, settled in. I mean, it's not like the most flattering uh -oh. outfit, <laughs> but it will do. Very cute. <laughs> I mean, it suits my skin color at the moment because I got a little bit of a sunburn. <laughs> Please prepare 30 pieces. Pardon? 30 pieces. 30 pieces. Okay, well, it looks like we're all set to go. We had to pay 700 at the reception area, you know, we paid for the activity and 30 here. I don't know if that's like an entrance price or something, but um, yeah, looks like we're going into the canopies now. I mean, but look at that, like even the GoPro is not even doing that justice, how incredibly high and amazing that looks. I think we're going to get started. Oh, this is quite a rocky start. Yeah, so you can imagine this. On your flip-flops is not going to be very easy <laughs> oh <laughs> the girl in front of me does it yeah so we just still like, climb some rocks oh my gosh Ooh. this is extremely slippery oh. okay this is not just a <laughs> canopy this is also like some rock climbing i guess Okay, not too bad. We have the rocks here. That's, I think, where the canopy is starting. But they were not joking when they said sharp and slippery. 
trigger. I mean, look at that. That will really hurt you. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna get attached to a cable above the canopy. Yeah. Safety first. <laughs> Thank you. Oh wow, look at that. Oh my gosh, this thing is wobbling so much. Okay. <laughs> Guys, walk slowly. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we got quite the drop down there. <sighs> this thing is wobbling so bad. I usually don't really get nervous, but this is... <laughs> oh, but look at the views. <laughs> okay guys, this is really not the easiest to film because this thing is so wobbly. <sighs> Free attached, thank you. Filming that was not the easiest task because that bridge definitely like sways so much, especially when you're with multiple people, like everybody's walking at a different place. So it gets a little bit scary. <laughs> but uh, the views are really very good. I like a very lush land jungle. <laughs> oh, watch your head. <laughs> yeah, we have branches and all of that. Oh man, I'm already out of breath. <laughs> Look at that. It's incredible. But no wonder you get like attached with a rope to the top because if the bridge is swinging like that. You could definitely tip, I think. <laughs> also, the heat. Not a joke. Definitely can recommend probably coming a little bit earlier when it's not this hot. shop and look at those rocks are first ocean views that's so beautiful oh how much longer do we go up <laughs> we're almost there perfect i'm dying <laughs> again mind your head man oh man <laughs> Okay, well, we've made it onto our platform. First platform with the view. I really still cannot get over like how incredible this water looks. Like it's so clear and so like blue and beautiful. You can see people chilling like on the beach, but just look at this. Like you have jungle over there and you have all of this beautiful, beautiful sea and like the little islands over there, more jungle and cliffs over there. <laughs> now I know this, this is only like the first part of our, uh, of our canopy walk. So there's a canopy walk and then you'll still have the dream catcher, which is like that very big round thing that you can actually sit on. It should be very cool. But it's so funny seeing like the town from the top because this morning I was walking past the like very modern, well, this building over there. <laughs> it looks so different when you're at, on the sky and above all the hustle and bustle. So look at the, look at these rocks. Now also when you're doing the actual hiking, these are the type of rocks that you're climbing over. So you can imagine if you do slip and fall, you can really, really seriously injure yourself. So yeah, I'm happy that I'm doing the canopy walk. Like I love adventure and I love uh, doing some uh, crazy things, but um, I definitely do not want to risk my safety on uh, rocks like that. I mean, if you get a guide, you're probably going to be okay, but um, yeah, I don't want to risk it. <laughs> Apparently the actual peak that you would go to when you're doing the rock climb is all the way up there. So you, yeah, if that is like the peak, this is where we are. Okay, on to the next part, which will be the dream catcher. Oh, I love how we're going through all these beautiful plants and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Up we go again. Oh no, <laughs> going on another one of these things. Well, here it is. Oh my gosh. Getting attached again. Oh, oh my goodness. Here we go. 
Come to the dream, guys. <laughs> Looks like you have like the two nets, one there, one over there. The only thing is like because you're attached with this rope, basically, uh, I'm the last one in, so I can't really move unless somebody else moves. Uh, <laughs> which is okay, like everybody can take the time with their photos. But still, views over there are so lush again. Gotta say, if you're trying to look for uh, El Nido from a different perspective than the islands or the water or down the ground, then you must definitely go and try and find something that is going to take you a little bit up in the sky because to see these rocks and the islands and all the jungle and the ocean is really beautiful. Okay, so that wasn't that long. I think we're going to be walking down now, so that didn't take uh, very long. But I mean, like, yeah, I don't know what else you'd be doing up here anyways, besides looking at the view and taking photos. So we're going to head down now. Thank you. Okay, we are unattached again, which feels a little bit scary. <laughs> Gosh, we're gonna have to go back to that swing bridge again. <laughs> Oof, okay, we're gonna have to through some very sharp rocks. You don't wanna fall on that. It's also like there's some sort of cave in the cliff there. Oh my gosh, look at that. Okay. Oh, it actually looks like we're going to another dream dungeon. Okay. There's another one down there. Oh my gosh. Okay, as you can see, like this wobbles even. onto this like tiny rope here oh my gosh but they're also really holding holes in that okay i am sweating absolute balls this is a very fun experience but it's also very very warm like even the handlebars the grips are becoming quite hot in the sun i'm definitely gonna need like something with sugar and rehydration now silly me also forgot my suntan lotion so i'm gonna have to get some more suntan lotion before i go to my second activity because even yesterday, I went kayaking and my sunburns were so bad, even though I did put suntan lotion on. <laughs> okay, let me just focus. Back on solid ground. <laughs> Made down safe. Okay, let's get some fresh air in my very sweaty head. Oh. Okay, well, I've equipped myself with a bottle of Coca-Cola and a small bottle of sunscreen because I was definitely burning up. I look absolutely terrible. Like, I'm just one sweaty red mess. <laughs> but we're going to be troopering on. I'm going on to my next activity. I just want to first see how we're going to get there because I actually want to go zip lining, which is all the way on the other side by another beach. So let's see if we can actually find a tricycle to get there. Okay, so <laughs> not much of a search, but we got a tricycle. Uh, it's going to be 150 to get down to the zip line. of where the zipline journey will be beginning as you can see on the board it is a 320 meter walk upwards <laughs> up this very steep hill in like midday so i mean like for whoever wants to have uh like what did they say you work hard for the, the result or something like this or if it's something that you want you need to work for it well we're working those legs for the zipline today <laughs> oh my god that is the zipline it's gonna be long so this is actually an island hopping zip line. We're gonna get across the sea to an island, <laughs> which I think is pretty insane. Oh my gosh. Oh 
made it. <laughs> hey. Okay. Uh, yes, please. <laughs> yeah, I could use some water. Okay. Okay, guys. So we have arrived. Now you guys have different types of uh, zip lining options, right? Yes. Yes, mom. Okay. Maybe which one, mom? One we sitting or combination? Uh, combination, mom. Back and forth. Sitting first, going back. Superman. Okay. Your land, your landing area, mom, is behind that hostel. The landing is behind the hostel. Yes. Okay, so going there, you're going out to that island. You walk up again. You walk up again. And then you come back behind the hostel. But then, uh, how do you do one way? You can't do if one. You need to do one way. You walk back. You walk the cross the sandbar. From the island. Yes. We're not doing that. <laughs> we will take a double way. And how much is a two way? Well, actually, yeah, let's do the combination because then I can do one sitting and one Superman. Superman yeah. I've never done a Superman zip line, so that would be quite cool. Do you think your name's Okay, I'll start signing. Yes, yeah, so we're doing the combination, which is 1,100. So you have different options. So also if you're doing like just a single way and you're walking back, it's going to be obviously cheaper than if you're doing both ways. But I really do not see myself in this heat, walking across the sandbar to the beach area, then coming up here, getting to my tricycle drive and then going back. I mean, I'm really dead from that walk up. So we're just going to do the, the two way and uh, it's a combination of sitting in Superman, so that's good. That is where we're going to. That little island in the background. <laughs> so I, th I don't know if you can see it from here with the super vi wide view, but you do have that sandbag that w walks back. I don't know where you would exactly get to if you go there, but we're going to go this way. And I'm trying to look for the other line. I can't actually see it. But you're going to walk up and you're going to go down that way again. But first, time for some safety. <laughs> Face on me. Face you. If you reach the landing area, you need to go down to the island. All Did right. You see the Am I back? Yeah, you can put inside. Uh, put this inside? On your, uh, your body. Oof. Okay, that looks a little scary. Copy up, boys. Line one is a to distance and it's a dose combination. Line up, line up. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> Can you turn on me? One on the back for the Superman, I'm guessing? Yeah, that is for that photo. <laughs> so, ma'am? Yeah. So, sitting first and then going back Superman. Okay. okay. So you only have to do is just only hold, hold here this. and then don't touch this one. And don't touch this. Yes, well. So we have a break there. The break will cause an impact at the end. Watch your head. Uh, so lean back and then feet up. Feet up. Yeah. <sighs> Sit down. If you experience the spinning backward, that is normal. That is normal. Okay. Sit down. Oh my God. Okay. Straight your legs. Okay. Lean back. Lean back. All the way like that. Not well, too much. Not too much. Yeah, like that. Okay. In three. Two, Thank you. One, enjoy. Oh. <laughs> wow! Look at that! <laughs> Very nice kick, give me the ball! <laughs> <coughs> okay, so we did number one, which was a sitting. Now we're gonna go this way. So we're readjusting everything. Okay, we need to go up to the next platform. Okay, this is another sturdy walk. 
yeah, these the activities I think definitely would be a lot easier if you're not doing them in midday heat. Once I'm finished with this, I'm probably gonna have to go and have a nap or something. I'm absolutely finished. Oh my gosh, it is such a walk. Do I stand on here? Huh? Oh. Lena, come on. I hold this. And lay down. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hand go. Oh my god. Before you landing, head down, okay? Okay, before the landing, because we put... Because the brake system down there kind of bumpy, okay? Okay, okay, okay. You know, it's good to hold on. I hold this. Okay, and my bag, I've got my bag, okay. Take a video. Yeah, my bag. I'm just worried about my bag. If you start, then turn it. Okay. I'm going to turn it to get you. The bag. Okay. Oh, my God. Yeah, I think so. Okay, go. Oh, bye. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, where are we going? Oh, I can't do anything. Where are we? <laughs> wow, this is not comfortable when you're laying like this. Where do I go? Okay. Can you stand up under the table? Oh, I can try. Okay, um, no, I'm too high. Okay. Oh, I can't do it. <laughs> Oh, I'm good, yeah, thank you. <laughs> oh, okay. Whew. Wow. <laughs> that was a completely different experience than when you're doing it sitting. Yes. Can okay. you go down here? I go down here? Yes. Okay. Oh, okay. And where do I go after? Yeah, one moment. Okay. My head is so sweaty. Yes, very sweaty. Oh, okay. Line up, line up. Okay. Well, that's it. Finished uh, the zip lining. That was a lot, a lot, a lot of fun. Now, if I had to choose between the two activities, I would say the zip lining is a lot more fun. Um, but of course, this is going to be for, well, depending on like your adventure level as well. The canopy walk was nice, but I mean, I don't know. It was, it was nice views. But if you go and compare that for 400 bucks more, you're doing a double way zip line and you're going to like this island, you get the views of the ocean and everything. I think. That was a lot more fun. <laughs> Just trying to catch my breath. Okay, I think this is actually also where I'm gonna round off the video because I need to walk up, go down to the beach, and then try and find my way back to my hostel. I'm out of breath, I'm tired, and that's because of the midday sun. So I'm really suggesting if you're doing these activities, do them when it's a little bit cooler. Oh my gosh, I look absolutely terrible. Um, but they are a lot of fun and it is a great way to see the views here in El Nido. Now guys, if you enjoyed this video, Oh, contemplate maybe hitting the subscribe button so you can see more of my videos. Thank you for coming all the way to the end of this video and I really hope to see you in the next. Bye.